Hello everyone, Namaste. Welcome back to my channel, Academy Tuber. Today we are going to discuss Unit 3 from Grade 10 Science, that is Life Cycle of P. Before that, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe the channel and for more updates, hit the bell icon. If you want more videos related to this, please like and do share these videos among your friends. And also don't forget to give your valuable response in the comment section. Honeybee. Honeybee is a social insect which is very important for human beings. It feeds on nectar of flower and produces nutritious honey. Honeybee exhibits work division of superior quality and they are very busy. They live in hive. There are three types of bee in the hive. They are queen bee, drone bee and worker bee. The mouth part of bees are uh, chewing and sucking type. External structure of a bee. They have a hard outer scale called uh, called an exoskeleton. They have three main body parts, that is head, thorax, and abdomen. They have a pair of antennae that uh, are attached to their head. They have three pair of uh, legs used for walking, and they have two pair of wings. Onwe and their roles. On we have different roles and responsibilities within the hive. First one is queen bee. The queen bee is the star of the hive. The largest and longer bee in the colony. The queen is the only female bee with fully developed ovaries and is capable of laying eggs. She releases, she releases pheromones to regulate the colony. Next one is drone bee. The drone is a male honeybee and uh, its body is black and hairy. Drones make up about 10 to 15 percent of the colony. The primary function of a drone is to mate with the queen. Drone complete uh, with one. Drones compete with one another during the mating flight. Once a drone bee uh, mates with a queen, it dies uh, shortly after. And next one is worker bee. The worker bee keeps the hive functioning. Depending on its age, the worker bee will play different roles in the hive. The young worker bee acts as a nurse bee, nurturing and feeding bee larvae, as well as processes nectar, feeds the queen, and makes uh, and caps the honey. An older an older worker bee is on for aging duty. Life cycle of honeybee. The life cycle of honeybee consists of four uh, distinct stages. Uh, they are egg, larva, pupa, and adder. This entire process varies lengthwise amongst the different honeybees. It takes about 16 days for a queen bee, 18 to 22 days for the worker's bee, and 24 days for the drones. Eggs. It is the first stage of life cycle of honeybee. The queen bee lays of uh, the queen bee lays from 2,000 to 3,000 days a day uh, eggs a day in the honeycomb one in each cell. The fertilized eggs which will become female honeybees, worker bees are laid in smaller cells as opposed to the unfertilized eggs which becomes male honeybees drones. The egg remains vertical in the first day, stranded in the second day, and falls down in the third day. Larva. Larva it is the second stage of life cycle of honeybee. Three days after an egg is laid, it hatches into a worm-like form called larva. The larva has no legs, wings, or antennae. A larva that is fed only royal jelly, a substance segregated from the glands of a nurse bee, will emerge from its cells known as the queen cell as a queen bee. Or the larvae which grow into worker bees and drones are fed royal jelly for their two to three days and then switch to turn bee bread, pollen and honey. So here is a diagram showing the life cycle of a honey bee. Pupa. The pupa is kept within the cell with wax. It is immortal and does not take any food. 
The people, the people issues of Queen B remains for eight days. That of Walker B is twelve days, and Drone B is fourteen days. Development of axonal organs takes place in this stage. Next one is adult. It is the last stage of life cycle of honeybee. Generally, queen bee develops within 15 to 16 days from the egg. Worker bee develops within 20 to 21 days, and drone bee develops within 22 to 24 days. The body structure and function of the queen, drone, and worker bee differs on the basis of types of these species. The development of different species of honeybee is presented below. So, honeybee, egg, larva, pupa, adult, uh, queen bee, uh, egg, 3 days, larva, 5.5 days, pupa, 7.5 days, and adult, 16 days. Similarly, worker bee, egg, 3 days, larva, 6 days, pupa, 12 days, adult, 21 days. Similarly, drone bee, egg uh, for 3 days, larva, 6 days, pupa, 14.5 days, and adult, 23 days. Here is a table showing the type and age of honeybee and their functions and duties. First one is queen bee. So, its duty or function is to lay egg and to control and guide the colony by releasing the uh, pheromones, uh, special order, which unites the member of the colony. Next one is drone uh, and function of drone is to fertilize the queen. Similarly, worker of 1 to 3 days, uh, its uh, function is to give warm to egg, larva and pupa and uh, to clean the cells. Uh, next one, worker of uh, 4 to 6 uh, days. Its function is to feed all the larva with honey and pollen. Uh, next one, worker uh, of 7 to 11 days old. Its function is to feed uh, Royal jelly produced from their uh, nurse lands to the queen and younger larva below 3 days. Next one is worker of uh, 12 to 17 days old. Uh, the function of that worker bee is to produce wax and build a honeycomb and uh, to seal the cells of the larva and honey. Similarly, worker of 18 to 20 days old, its function is to protect the beehive from enemies and ventilate the hive. And the worker uh, after 21 days uh, function is to collect nectar, uh, pollen and propolis. So here is a diagram showing uh, the duties of uh, worker bees. This diagram shows the duties of uh, honeybee as per their age. Now we are going to discuss economic importance of honeybee. First one is honey. Honey, it is a sticky aloes brown fluid made by bees from nectar collected from flowers eaten as a sweet food. And it is used for following purpose. First, it is a fat free, cholesterol free and sodium free food stuff for human. It is used as Ayurvedic medicine. It is used to treat mental weakness, tuberculosis, stomach ache, heart disorder and eye dis diseases. It is used to treat a bladder infection, reduce allergy and ulcers, minimize hair loss and maintain better uh, blood sugar and weight and uh, weight loss. Next one is bee wax. The wax secreted by bees to make honeycombs and used to make different cosmetic items such as cream, lipstick, uh, beauty, lotion, polish, etc. is called bee wax. Next one is bee royal jelly. It is a substance secreted by worker, uh, honeybee workers and feed by them to larva uh, which are being raised as a potential queen bees. And it is used for the following purpose. Uh, it is used as medicine for the treatment of human influenza, high blood pressure, respiratory infection, eye diseases and healing uh, old wounds. It is also used to make a skin uh, care products, toiletry goods, uh, candles, uh, shaving creams and cold creams. It is believed to have some anti-aging properties. Next one is B propolis. It is a dark brown uh, resinous waxy material made by worker bees by mixing saliva and bee wax. It has following benefits. It is used as a medicine for common cold, sore throat, uh, tonsillitis, uh, bronchitis and dental infection. It is effective in eliminating mouth ulcers, skin diseases and ringworm. It increases 
gynecological treatment and fertility in women. Next one is B venom. It is a colorless apitoxin acidic liquid that is secreted from the acid glands of worker bees. The use of B venom are as follows. It is used as antifungal, antibacterial and anti-cancer drug and it is used in the form of relief tablets or injection for the treatment of pains at joints. It is used in screen therapy as well and it is used to uh, lower blood pressure and cholesterol levels. Next one is pollination. On a alone pollinates 80% of all flowering plants including more than 130 types of fruits and vegetables. Other values. So bees are the diligent uh, social insects that live in a colony uh, where a good division of labor exists. After studying their hard work in nature, uh, ethics and lifestyle human beings can be inspired a lot to implement the lifestyle of honeybees in their daily life. Note. The unfertilized egg of a honeybee is haploid and uh, contains 16 chromosomes while the fertilized egg of a bee is diploid and contains 32 chromosomes. Drone bee hatches from unfertilized egg and queen and worker bee hatches from the fertilized egg. Uh, okay, so next one is swarming. It's the process in which the queen bee leaves the colony with a large group of worker bee to form a new colony. The new queen takes uh, the place of the former queen uh, of the former uh, queen gone for swarming. Next one is royal jelly. Uh, it is a protein-rich, uh, whitish, uh, milky fluid produced from the nose glands of worker bee where, uh, when they are seven to eleven days old. Younger larvae and the queen are fed only with the royal jelly. Next one is nuptial or mating flight. A mature queen bee comes out of hive and fly in the air for mating with drones and this flight is called mating or nuptial flight. Next one is Militology or Apiology. The study of honeybee is known as Militology or Apiology and the beekeeper is called uh, Apiarist. The place where bees are kept is called an apiary. So here is one question, why is honeybee called social insects? Honeybee it is called social insect because of following reasons. Uh, it lives in colony and there is a division of labor in which individuals carry out particular duties. Next one, apiculture. The process of managing and breeding honeybee for acquiring honey and bee wax is known as apiculture or beekeeping. Apiculture is an old tradition that is started with hunters in the forest in search of sweet honey. Next one is beehive. A beehive is a place where bee lives. It is a structure that a bee uh, colony calls home. A colony is the family unit consisting of a queen worker, drones, uh, uh, worker bee and drones. Next one is molting. The shedding or casting off of an outer layer or covering and the formation of its replacement is called molting. The larva of honeybee moves for five, four to five times. Differences between drone bee and workers. Drone bee it is fertile male whereas worker bee it is sterile female. Drone bee it is larger, worker bee it is smaller. Function of drone bee is to fertilize queen bee whereas the function of worker is to collect nectar, protect the hive and feed the feed to larvae. Next one differences between uh, drone bee and queen bee. Drone bee it is uh, male honey bee whereas uh, queen bee it is uh, fertile female honey bee. Drone bee it is uh, smaller than uh, queen bee whereas queen bee it is larger than drone. By this we have come to the notes of this unit life cycle of bee. I hope this video was useful to you. If you like this video please uh, share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any queries drop the comment in the comment section. See you on the next video. Thank you.